Today on our 2015 Chevrolet Malibu, we're doing a test fit of the Inno Aero crossbars. The part number for the crossbars we're using in the back here is INXB108. For our front bar, we're using INXB115. Our foot pack is going to be INSX200. And the fit kit we're using is INK116. So we already have our back bar on. We're going to show you how we put the front bar together with that last foot pack and then also how we put that onto our vehicle. So we've got one of them on. We're going to take our other foot pack and just slip it into the spot here with our already placed metal bracket. We're just going to Pull that out till that situates in the correct spot and tighten it up just a bit. Now I've gone ahead and removed this bolt, put on the clamp and tightened it down just a bit so it keeps that clamp in place and placed on our rubber foot there. And if we keep this loose enough, we'll be able to still move the pack around. We want about 38 inches between the two crossbars. So that's about right. So we'll just tighten this down the rest of the way. And there's a spot for the bolt to tighten down in that metal bracket there. And once those line up, we'll be able to secure it in place. So just double check. All right, with those in place, now we can open up our front doors. And we'll loosely install our crossbar. Just going to readjust the clamps, make sure everything's sitting the right way, and we'll check our spread here. So from the inside door jam to the middle of our clamp, we want 35 centimeters. That one's in the right spot. And with those in the right spot, we can start tightening them down with the included tool. I'll just tighten down with my hand so the clamp sits just up against the door. Now I'll do the same to the other side. Now 
And now we can take our included torque tool. We're just gonna tighten down each side evenly. I like to do about five turns on either side. The key is to do it evenly so we don't have our crossbar pulling from one side or the other to make that crossbar sit uneven. Now one thing you will notice on the front and back bars is that we do have that gap there. If we check out our bars here, we've got a gap in that rain channel there. So it's the same in the front and the back. It's just going to sit a little odd on there. And once you hear that pop, that's going to be like a gas cap noise. That's when you know that you've put enough torque on that side and that's gonna prevent you from over tightening your crossbars. We'll just do the same on this one. We'll close up our doors and we can place on our locking end caps. Simply place end cap on and lock that into place. And we'll do the same over here. And we're all ready to hit the road. So that's going to be our completed look at the NO Aero crossbars and how they fit on our 2015 Chevrolet Malibu.